People in Decatur are demanding answers from city leaders following that deadly shooting. They took those demands to Decatur City Council meeting today. Way 31's Matty McCaffrey was in that, excuse me, Paige Meyer was in that meeting today. And Paige, I imagine this was one of the more heated council meetings in a while. That's right, over a dozen community members spoke at today's council meeting, all of them wanting answers on the Steve Perkins investigation. Now, many of those people telling city leaders to stand with the Decatur community and hold the Decatur Police Department accountable for what happened on September 29th. Decatur Police Chief Todd Pinion attended today's meeting, and some people even addressed him directly. However, frustration began after the council was unable to answer many questions. In particular, in particularly, nothing was said in response to what happened to the officers involved in the shooting. The city council cited Aaliyah's ongoing investigation. The NAACP president, Rodney Gordon, is one who thinks the Decatur Police Department needs to be held accountable for Perkins' death. If we don't put the pressure on this council, okay, and this police chief to make an arrest, then that's, that's going to be a problem. That's not a threat. But that's going to be a problem. Gordon says if the Decatur officers are held accountable now, it will hopefully prevent something like this from happening again. After the meeting, I asked Chief Pinion to comment, and he declined. I also reached out to Aaliyah again today, and there are no updates on the Perkins investigation at this time. Now, in the next hour, we're going to take a look and listen to what one of the council members has to say about what the council is planning on doing about this investigation. Reporting live in Decatur, Paige Meyer, Wait 31 News.